All right, welcome back. It's your boy Juice back at it again. You already know what's popping with my gabagoos. Ah, hey, but we uh we about to hit you with another little bit of fitness knowledge, a little bit of fitness influencer basic training. Okay, uh, a little bit of a little bit of a meal plan and, and how I concoct my meal plan and how I, you know, make sure that I keep gaining. Uh, I just had to. Whip up a little bit. I had to add my little. My, I had to change it up a little bit. You know what I'm saying? A little bit today, cause your boy has been gaining some weight. Your boy is now two plates, fucking big. Ah, that means I'm 225. Actually, I did hop on the scale and I was more of a 222. But and, and I'm assuming that normally I'd be like a 220 because I don't weigh myself that often. But also I just like eating half of my breakfast so I was probably a little bit more uh, a little bit you know fuller right <clears throat> but I still want to gain weight so I'm putting myself at 225 and eating as if I was 225 and I'm on a bulk I figured I could take this time to show you how I you know make my plan and then I also just finished making a little diet plan for my homie who's actually trying to lose weight rather than gain it so I figured, hey, you know, two, two and one. That's a, that's a two and one. That's a, that's a bogo, baby. So we're about to pop up in there, and uh, you know, just, just, just show you what's going on, right? So <clears throat> my maintenance calories would have been, and you know, just to show you what calculator I use to get this, right? We're gonna go. This is the. This is the calculator that I use. This is not my macros, but whatever. Uh, this is the calculator, it's freedieting.com. Uh, and this is the nutrition calculator, it's called nutritionvalue.org. I'll put the the deets in the description. And yeah, so got my got my calories to start bulking as if I was at 225. And that's a 300 calorie, at least from what I've learned, you know, from more plates, more dates from you know mark bell from all the motherfuckers that i watch on youtube right everything that i've been training for from and whatnot they say to eat in like a 300 surplus 300 calorie surplus or excess or whatever it is that you want to call it right so that's what i've been doing it's been working and you know i don't gain i don't get weight ugh, i don't gain weight that fast either way um and i also don't i'm not able to eat that much because it's just i don't know it's hard for me to eat a lot so going with a lower excess such as a 300 calorie excess is a little bit easier for me to actually get everything down because to be completely honest even my maintenance calories are difficult to get down so it's like a hey, you know I, I start where I can maybe maybe eventually when I can get the drugs and stuff to make me eat more I'll do that but for right now I'm, I'm natty baby I'm, I'm raw I'm, I'm, I'm fucking I'm fucking piping this shit down. No, no latex, baby. Okay. And hopping right into this. I am doing one gram of protein per pound of body weight uh, that I have. Okay. And then 0 0.3 grams per pound of body weight. So then for carbs, I'm going to be doing double my body weight, right? I know it says 430. I need to switch that around real quick. Uh, to 450 Let's hop up into the meat and potatoes of this real quick the steak the steak meal the red meat meal The the best meal of the day in my opinion. I usually start with my meat and get all my protein in um, And usually my fat too and Then I'll add my carbs and and go go like that Just to make sure that I get like okay, because in my opinion the protein is what I'm needing to build my muscle, and the, and the carbs are like energy, right? Um, and and I'm, I'm really just trying to build muscle. I'm not so much trying to put on, I'm not trying to dirty bulk, you know? So I do eat carbs, but my main priority is to get the protein down, right? Like if, I, if I'm too full, I'd rather have eaten all my protein than have eaten all my carbs, you know what I'm saying? Um, but regardless, I, I go through all my steak, uh, all my, my protein and my fat requirements first, and then I fit in my, my carbs. Obviously, I'm going to try and make it so that my calories still work and I have all of my macros properly accounted for. 
Uh, but sometimes if the carbs are a little bit lower than what I'm going for, which again, this is this is not the correct carb count right now. I fucked up. I need to I need to go through that at the end of this, and I'll I'll show you what it actually is in a minute. But if it's if it's a little too low on the carbs, I'm not going to be tweaking out too hard about that. I'd rather get the protein and the fat. Um, move on to the chicken meal. I'm sure you've probably noticed by now I am doing the vertical diet. Uh, I don't actually, I haven't bought it. Uh, once I do have like a hundred bucks lying around to just, you know, throw at something, I'm definitely going to buy it, but it's pretty easy to find all the information for the most part. There's definitely some stuff you can't find online for free, but for the most part, he, Stan has like dropped a lot of the knowledge in like videos and stuff. If you just have the time to look around and do some research, so that's what I've done. Uh, this, that's what I'm kind of going by. Um, I know. Oh yeah. And also, I know the first meal is a little, is a little weak, is a little bare bones. But I do add some like carrots or something like that. I usually drink some OJ as well. I don't really count the calories on the on the juices for the most part. I just you know drink what I need. I, I'm not super strict. I just get what I need in there and you know build around that um so i mean i'm definitely not like the idolized you know i'm not the master i'm not probably the thing you're trying to model yours after but hopefully i can help you figure out what you're trying to go for and kind of like help you knock this out and, and and find where to start because you know it is kind of difficult and you know it's, it's hard to it's hard to figure out where to start sometimes. So like hopefully hopefully that's that's what this video right here is gonna accomplish, right? All right, moving on. Chicken meal, uh, chicken usually breasts, but you know sometimes it's thighs. This is calculated for breasts, I believe. Um, but you know if if you do thighs, you're gonna just have a little bit more fat. You know, maybe maybe throw that in your notebook or something like that, or on your phone, on your notes, and just say like, "Yo, I had thighs." You know, calculate that real quick. You know, before you portion out all your foods before the beginning of the week or at the beginning of the week, right? Uh, and then we got a rice, two and a half cups. Again, whole whole foods is part of the vertical diet, so that stuff is kind of digesting fast and, and easy on your stomach. Um, you can put some chicken broth on this, which usually there already is chicken broth if it's if it's rice or like sometimes it's ramen noodles and stuff like that which i've gone over in my other videos um corn tortillas this is kind of calculated for tacos which i was making for a little while so i should probably switch it up but i know i know it's about the same with what i'm eating right now but you know it, it's just kind of good to have like a couple different meals maybe and I don't really have the time to be out here like putting in every single fucking meal I'm eating um, I just know that I'm eating the right amount because uh, I've been doing this shit for a decent amount of time this is like the fucking eighth eighth fucking meal plan I've made so I'm kind of I, I can kind of tell how much I'm eating and how much I need to eat so that I can keep gaining weight because I, I know the measurements at this point. I don't have to measure them out, if you know what I'm saying. I'm making this now and I should really update this. So I'll make another one next week with my updated version um, and you know, see how much it changed. Regardless though, fucking, that's that's chicken meal, right? Again, did the, uh, did the protein, the fats first and then just kind of worked my rice in and whatnot. Uh, breakfast, right? Eggs. Four, four eggs, um, fucking turkey sausage, four ounces, Tillamook cheese, uh, 28 grams, and rice, which to this day, I, I, I put spinach in this, but it's the exact same. So is the steak meal. The only real difference is, is the chicken meal with the fact that it has corn tortillas and uh, Tillamook cheese. So it, it's, it's pretty much the same, but there's a little bit of a difference uh, to what I usually eat right now. Um, and you know, and then I, then I, you know, I have my totals under each one of these, so I can calculate it a little bit easier. Um, and yeah, moving on. This is uh, my homie who is actually trying to lose weight. So comparing this to what I'm trying to do to gain weight to my homie who's trying to lose weight, 
just made this for him a little bit ago, right? Get this, get this drank. Ah. And uh, same kind of skeleton to this, same working of this, okay? I made sure that I got all of his protein and his fat in here at the beginning before adding or worrying about any type of carbs, okay? So I had egg. He's trying to stay lower on the fat, right? So it's 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 really okay. Like this this right here is what it would normally be to just like maintain and right and maintain the stuff, right? Um not the carbs, but this level of fat is what it would be to maintain, right? So going even a little bit lower than this, which we ended up with 45, is all right. It's, it's actually kind of a move um, if you're trying to lose weight, right? He is 5'7", weighs 180, so we're doing the 180 grams of protein for him. And then seeing as he's not trying to bulk, we're going to shoot for... 180 grams, same body weight uh, in carbs, right? Which we actually got a little bit lower, which again is fine because he's trying to lose weight. As long as I get a good protein, which I'm actually six grams above, that's my main thing that I'm worrying about, okay? So, starting from the bottom, now we hear um, whole egg, one whole egg, because eggs are very fatty. They have seven fucking grams of fat in, in one egg, all right? Uh, calculate the calories, right? And then I'm subbing out so he can still get a decent amount of protein. We got the egg whites, which is 15 grams of protein, a little bit of fat, it's like a quarter gram of fat, and then we got a carb. Uh, turkey sausage is a good way to get some lean protein in with your breakfast. Uh, doesn't have that much fat and has a decent amount of protein. <clears throat> it is a processed meat, but you know you kind of have to make some some uh, some cuts where you can. You gotta cut some edges where you got where you got it. Um, and then you know I'm just gonna run you through how I, I just literally like made it. So then I have 200 grams of grilled chicken breast or broiled or like you know stewed. I'm just having him keep track of how he cooks it so that I know, so that I can calculate, you know, at the end of the week or maybe at the beginning of the week, depending on when he cooks it, you know, what's going on. Just making sure that I can kind of change it for him depending on how he's cooking it that week, if you get me. So 200 grams, just base grilled chicken breast, 64 grams of protein, 4.4 grams of fat, um, and then we got, uh, okay, and then I'm moving on to meal three. Then we got our 200 grams of sirloin steak, which, you know, you can marinate that if you want. Um, just, you know, again, keep track of it. Keep track of how you're cooking it, okay? So we got regular just top sirloin steak. No real way of cooking it um, right now. And that's got 54 grams of protein and 22 grams of fat, so... Sirloin is a little bit fatty, but it's good for you and you need it. Uh, and then two, two carbs somehow, but whatever. Uh, and then, so I have all my protein and my fat needs taken care of. And now I'm going to fit in with the rest of my calories what I can with carbs, okay? So he wants to do quinoa or quinoa. Uh, I don't really care how you say it. I, I think quinoa sounds funnier, so I'm going to say quinoa. I know it's pronounced quinoa, but... Hey, fuck them. So we got uh, fucking 1.5, one and a half cups of quinoa. And that's going to come out. Bro, quinoa actually has a large amount of protein in it, which I didn't realize. But hey, bro, it's it's not a bad not a bad sub for some carbs. Um, not as much as white rice. Doesn't have as many carbs as a cup of white rice does. I think a cup of white rice has 45 grams of carbs. But, hey, dude, fuck it, dude, honestly. So, yeah, then we got 12 grams of protein, um, 7.2 grams of fat, which, again, wild, didn't realize that, um, and then 60 grams of carbs. 
uh, and that's just one and a half cups. And then again, another cup, uh, one cup is gonna be eight grams of protein, um, three and a half grams of fat, and 40 grams of carbs. All right, and then another half, uh, one and a half grams of quinoa, and you know, then we get, we, we get there. And then I do give him the option of adding bell peppers or spinach in the morning for, you know, a little bit of difference. Uh, carrots in the in the you know lunch or whatever he has this meal and then add bell peppers to or onions I should put onions in there too and then he's going to have his protein with I, I believe he's doing almond milk okay um, just to kind of get some extra protein in there which he really doesn't need because uh, this this bottom number right here uh, this bottom protein number is everything without the protein from the quinoa, right? So he really does not need this right here. But, you know, if he wants it, it he, he wants to be able to stay full throughout the day, which I think the, the, the quinoa is gonna do for him and he's gonna be fine. But, you know, I'm giving him the option right now to do the, the, the protein powder um, and hopefully you know, hopefully he doesn't need it, but at the same time, if he does, it's literally just protein, which, you know, it get, you could argue that it's gonna, you know, just turn into fat or like sugar or whatever protein does when you get too much of it, but I'm doubting that he's gonna actually need it. And if he does, he's just gonna let me know and we're gonna keep note. And at the end of this week, we're gonna go over, you know, how it did, how he went, and if he was hungry, you know, how he's feeling on it and, you know, make some changes because Hey bro, you know, it's all experiments. It's all just kind of like flying by the seat of your pants. You, you gotta you gotta try it out and uh, you know, there's gonna be a little bit of failure. There's gonna be a little bit of uh, success and you know, you just gotta see what works. And honestly, that's that's like how I kind of been doing my whole fitness journey at this point is, you know, I just try stuff out. I really do need to get back on keeping track because I, I have kind of figured out a lot of stuff that works for me uh, in the gym and in the kitchen, you know, and I think I'm at the point where I can start keeping track again and, and like, you know, dialing in a little bit. But I mean, honestly, I'm pretty happy with my physique right now. Um, I've been making gains and, you know, I, I, I've been enjoying the gym and how I've been doing it. So maybe, maybe I don't need to fix what's not broke, but hey, either way, you can always get better. I'll figure it out. <clears throat> but shit, hey, right, that's, that's about as much as I wanted to go over in this video. Um, hopefully I was able to you know, throw some knowledge at you, you know, and blast y'all with some, with some wisdom, you know what I'm saying? Uh, hopefully you kind of understood what I'm saying. I know I was kind of a little, little scatterbrained in the beginning. Um, but hey bro, it's, it's the, it's the first, first, you know, diet video. I'll get better in the next one. And hopefully I was able to help y'all out when I start somewhere and, you know, kind of, kind of get a little, a little grasp, a little, a little a uh, little plan down on, on how to how to do something and how to get this shit started but uh i appreciate y'all watching and uh hopefully see you in the next one bang bang